Want to keep up with the latest Komodo gaming videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Rescue HQ, and yes folks, we are back once again, and today we have a very important event that is about to happen, so I've been prepping for this, I don't know if I'm fully ready, but we're gonna go ahead and give it a go, because we don't have an option. Now what's happening is a football championship is coming to town, and it says it's gonna be messy, we might need some riot gear, probably medical, and yeah, it's gonna be a quite a event here, so let's go ahead and resume time. Now, if you missed last episode, I'll flash it in the top right corner. Uh, we actually started on the hospital area over here, so we'll probably continue to work on this today. Actually, we'll probably continue to work on everything, because it seems like the emergencies are just getting a little bit bigger each time. So, I've got some crews out right now. Uh, they're completing a couple of the emergencies that we've had. But yeah, we're just going to jump right back into here, uh, try to build this up, complete some special events, and try to unlock some more stuff in this game. So, if you guys are enjoying Rescue HQ on the channel, be sure to hit that thumbs up button, and if you guys have any suggestions for future games on the channel, maybe comment below. Alright, so we have three new emergencies that have just popped up. Problem is, this just popped up before the football championship, so I don't know if this is going to throw this all off. So, a local business is reporting smoke coming out. Uh, so we're going to go and send... Ooh, we need to send five of our firefighters. Uh, okay. You know, this is going to be fine. Uh, totally don't need to panic right now, the whole fact the football event is coming up. Alright, let's dispatch them. We got a combined medical and police event. It says, sports fans... Actually, this has got to be it. Here, is it not? Yeah, here it is. It says, supporters fight. So it says, sports fans have met on the street after a match and the situation escalated into violence. Some people have been injured. Now, we need riot gear for this, and that's something that I haven't unlocked yet. So we're just going to have to send in a buttload, which that's a, a good measurement. So we're going to send in a buttload of cops. We're going to send in the police van. Uh, we're we'll going to just send in one of those. We need to go ahead and send medical in. I'm assuming this is the event. Hopefully it is. There we go. So that's a 90% chance of success on that. So we'll send that in. And we have an additional police call. And this is still the sports fans. Man, these people are crazy. So it says the supporters have met in a pub and some fighting broke out. Go in and calm the spirits before they escalate. So I need to send in an additional uh, amount of cops. And oh dear. Uh, maybe another police van. That'll work. All right. You guys head out. And I actually think we're going to complete all three of those. Now, whether or not they throw in another big event after this, I'm actually kind of curious about that. So come on, police. Let's get moving here. We've got a bunch of rowdy football fans, which I'm actually talking about soccer fans. But I know a lot of people refer to it as football. So I'm going to respect that. So we have football fans that are riding here in the city. Oh, no. Three more events just popped up. No. Okay. So we got a local business, another uh, commercial fire, really. Uh, okay, let's go and attend to this. Oh, this is gonna get messy really quick. I can already tell you that. All right, let's go ahead and send out some crew. We'll send out just what we need. We want to go too overboard with it. So let's go ahead and send. Why can't I dispatch this? It says it's at 100%. Do I have to send another vehicle? Uh oh. Uh, okay, I have to send two vehicles. Okay, there goes that. We got another uh, medical and police here, and it's hooligans. So it says, violent fighting between fans is broken out right outside the local stadium. Multiple people injured, and the situation is out of control. Folks, we have riots in the city. This isn't good. All right, so I have two cops I can send. Oh, no. I don't have any gear I can send in with them. I've got a couple medical I should be able to send in. Oh, this is not good. This is not good at all. Um, we got an issue here, folks. I don't have enough cops. What is the time left on this? 37 minutes? Am I going to have any? Wait, actually, no. It's an hour. Okay, we're going to have to wait just a second for this event. So, I'm should... I think I'm going to have some cops arrive back at the station uh, before we send them out on this call. That way we can hopefully take care of the situation. We might be disappointing the, uh, the mayor here. Uh, okay, give it a little bit more time. Okay, we have to go now. All right, so here we go. We got some cops back in the station, so we're going to go ahead and deploy out. I can provide six. We can get a, uh, a riot van there. Let's go ahead and get the uh, couple medical here. Okay, there's a 60% chance that this is going to work. If Can I maybe make the odds a little bit better if I send in 
I don't know, another cop car, anything? I don't think we can get above 60 here, folks. This is gonna be close. All right, dispatch. So we got that, and we have an additional police call. Are you serious? Man, this is a tough event. All right, let's see if we can get a, another one in here. Let's see, what is it? Okay, this one isn't so bad, so I just have to send four cops out. Still don't have that riot gear, which is kind of a bummer, but that should be a good call there. All right, so as you can see, we have arrested some people here. So I think you can actually activate these and we should have cops come in and they'll start to handle the prisoners. Also, we appear to have some injured fans here. So let's go ahead, get some of the medical staff to start working on them. They're in the triage. I don't know what's going on there. It looks like the person exploded. All right, so they're working on them. Wow, we actually have a full blown working facility here. So should have them actually see the cops in here. They're questioning the people in the holding cell. Probably all the football fans here. Man, we're doing it right now. I think we might actually get away uh, with uh, doing this whole little event here. I was a little worried about it. I kind of thought we were going to fail it, but we're looking pretty good right now. Pretty toasty. All right, we got some more events that just popped up. We got a new fire. We've got a uh, another commercial fire, so it's really basic. We also just unlocked a whole bunch more stuff for the station. So we'll check that out here in a second. All right, dispatch them. Do we still have... Yep, we still have supporter fights. So the soccer championship is still going on right now. Uh, we'll send out some more police. Uh, we'll get some medical in the area. This should be fine. Okay, dispatch them. And looks like we have another supporter fights. You can see a little city map on the left side. And they are just breaking out all over the place. There's tons of brawls going on right now. So let's just try to keep the situation under control. Uh, we're getting by right now, which is pretty good. All right, so it is time to go ahead and unlock some new stuff. So as you can see, I've got a lot of new icons now. Uh, we got an outside icon, which is a shooting range for the cops. Uh, office, we have a detective desk, which is pretty cool. Utilities. Ah, look at this. This is stuff that we needed. The breaching gear is here. The riot gear is finally here. All right, so we're going to need a bigger utility room. Uh, for the cops, so what we're gonna do here, let's go ahead and expand this. This should fill in that empty gap in the station. We should be able to set up the new stuff in here. Alright, so for sure we need the riot gear, so let's go ahead and spend some reputation points. That's gonna cost 700. Holy man. That is, uh, a lot of our money is now gonna be gone. Okay. Yeah, it's kinda hard to manage the reputation points in this game, because it always wants you, uh, to get more to get up to the next level, but you have to spend it in order to get uh, a lot of the cool gear that you need. So let's go and go boom there. So that's gonna be a right gear. So is that only one? Do I need to put multiple in? Let's go ahead and put one more in here. There we go. So we got two of those. Uh, we'll have to gain some more reputation points. I wanna unlock the breaching gear because I've seen that requested on quite a few calls. And then we'll have to see what else we can unlock here. So we got riot gear, which obviously it's a little too late for that. Medical we've added, oh geez. Oh, man, there's ICU, resuscitation stations, heart investigations. This is a full-blown hospital. Like, there's a lot of stuff that you can actually add here, which is kind of surprising. So, I need one of these. This is going to be the medical kit. And I think we could start to bring these out uh, on calls. So, we're just going to stick it in here for the time being. And we'll have to expand the, uh, the hospital out a little bit more. But this should make it to where they can bring out extra kits on the uh, calls here. Sweet. All right, so we have a new call. We have another supporter fight. So this one, we're actually going to be able to deploy riot gear, which obviously it's a little late for that, but we've got two over here. So indeed, each of those stations is just one, which is a little annoying. All we need is one for this call. So let's go and get our doctors in. That should be a 95%. All right, yeah, now we finally got this under control. So let's go and get the other call. This is another supporter fight. I don't know how long this event's going to last, but I kind of wish it was over. All right, so we'll go another riot gear. Uh, we'll get our two medics, and we'll get the uh, old ambulance there. Now, I don't have any medical kits yet because the thing's still being built, but 95% should be good to go on that emergency. All right, let's hope that this ends really soon. <laughs> All right, so our hospital is getting a little bottlenecked here, so I think it's time to expand it out. So what I'm going to do... Let's go ahead and expand out the corridor out to here. We're going to go ahead and add to the garage because I think it's probably time to buy at least one more ambulance here. So we're going to do that. Let's go ahead and expand the garage out. Uh, we'll go about to there. Can I do anything new for medical? Oh, we can get a police pursuit vehicle now. 
Uh, we can get the uh, high range basket vehicles for the fire. There's a lot of new stuff. Uh, we can get the emergency ambulance, which I guess that's the same thing. Oh, this is like a little high powered one. We might do that here in a minute. It's basically a smaller one, but I don't want to waste the uh, reputation points yet because I want to go ahead and unlock the uh, next level. All right, so we'll put that there. So what we want to do here for the medical, we need to go ahead and expand this whole thing. So let's go and expand it out to here. There we go. I know it looks a little odd cramming everybody into one room, but that's kind of how you have to build in the game. Uh, because separating the rooms does you no good. Like, even if you try to put them separate, it's going to put them together. There's, like, no way to actually separate the rooms with walls. It'll just merge them. All right, so let's get some uh, triage stations. We'll get a couple more of those. Uh, I don't want to unlock anything else yet on this list. Uh, so we're going to wait there. Let's go and get another medicine cabinet since we have a, uh, a kind of an influx of new beds here. And then let's go and get one more crash cart in here. Uh, there we go. All right, so we're going to let them start to build that. That should uh, help our little influx uh, for the hospital. We'll start to research this more after we get the uh, 1,200 reputation points, though. All right, so apparently we have reached a reputation limit, so I need to spend actual money here. So what we're going to do... I got a couple more things unlocked. Wow. Oh, we can get a medical chopper. It says, get to the chopper. Well, before we get into that, one thing the medical really needs, I've been seeing a need for an intensive care unit. So we need to get an ICU unlocked. So let's go ahead and unlock it real quick. And we need to install a couple of these. So we'll go boom and boom. All right, so we got ICU. We've got 500 reputation points left. What should we invest in? Man, this is tricky now. I kind of really need to get these people a kitchenette set. I know it sounds weird to go like, hey, we need to get them some comfort, but I've noticed some people kind of hungry. So let's go to our kitchen here and look at that. We got a nice dining set that we just unlocked. So we've got that. Uh, bedroom, one thing I'd like to unlock for it to uh, make it to where I can keep this size of bedroom, even though we have more employees, we can put bunk beds in here now. So that's actually going to help us a lot. So I think I'm going to start stacking some bunks in here. Uh, actually, what we can do, let's go ahead and sell these beds off real quick. There we go. So sell all the beds. I like how they have pictures of elephants, uh, horses, and stuff like that in here. That's kind of weird. You would think this is more of a kid's room. All right, let's go ahead and place these there. There we go. We'll go ahead and stick these over here. All right, everybody's going to have a bed now. That should be good. Look at that. All right, so we fixed that. All right, so now we have to build up reputation points again. I'm still waiting to level up. That way I can actually complete the objective down here. It's kind of weird how we have to do this, but yeah, this is okay. All right, so we have a bit of an issue here. We are deploying so many police around the clock right now that we can't even keep up vehicle-wise. I'm almost thinking of merging here uh, the vehicle garage for the medical and the police, which I think it's going to be necessary uh, for the time being while we try to still get through this event. This is the longest event I have ever seen. I don't know why it's not ending yet. So let's go ahead and expand the garage out this way. And we're going to go ahead and add one more riot control. We're going to add them towards the end. That way I have room for a couple more medical vehicles. You know, let's go ahead and expand it even further. So let's go out to here. And then we're going to add in another cruiser here. There we go. All right, so we have a space for medical. So we'll keep the garages on the outside of the building. That way we can keep them uh, ready and deployed here. But yeah, it's been a tough event. Like, it's not ending. Like, look at our holding cell. It's just full of people right now. They're trying to get them out. We have tons of injured in here. Like, my medical staff is working around the clock right now to get this all taken care of. Uh, people are in ICU. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> Everybody's trying to rest right now. Ooh, boy. All right, so we are ready to buy some more things. So we're going to go to the fire utility room here. Uh, we're going to go ahead and buy the uh, the old breaching gear maintenance station. So this should make it to where we can have breaching gear. So we're going to stick... Let's go ahead and stick two of these in the fire maintenance room. Can we go... Let's go here and here. So we've got that. 
There's a foam extinguisher refill station, which we could probably use that, but we might need to invest it somewhere else. I mean, there's so many things to buy now. It's actually uh, getting pretty crazy. I feel like we should probably buy this, uh, the orthopedic station, I think that's what it is. Or we can buy the radiology station, which I think that's actually what they're requesting right now. So maybe we'll do that. So we'll add another station into our, uh, old hospital back here. We'll go and stick it on the wall here. There we go. Alright, let's keep busting out those, uh, points. I don't know if the soccer event's ever gonna end. Like, I, I feel like there's something wrong here. Like, I feel like it should have, uh, it should be gone by now. Alright, I think it's time to fill out the rest of this area. I'm still in need for more medical, so let's go ahead and add a corridor down to here. What we're gonna do, let's go ahead and expand the garage all the way to the end of the property here. And then the medical, we're gonna go ahead and extend it out too. Uh, because there's just such a need for it right now. We make actually quite a bit of money off our hospital, to be honest with you. Uh, which is pretty cool. So, let's go ahead and put another door down here. There we go. Alright, so we got another big thing that we're about to add. I don't know what's wrong with this football event. I don't know if it's ever going to end. But, one thing I've been wanting to do, and I think it would be pretty cool. We can get a medical helicopter in, which I think is awesome. So let's go ahead and unlock that. How does this... Wait, do I put this in a garage or do I put it outside? It says outside. So do we just stick it anywhere? Wait, we need to... Wait, can I buy this adjacent lot? Oh, I think we can. Huh, let's go ahead and unlock this. So we've unlocked all the land now. And we could just place a helicopter out here anywhere. So I think towards the corner would be good. So something like this. It won't let me stick it right on the corner. But yeah, let's go ahead and install this. This is expensive. 120000 but we've got the money, so boom. Wait, why can that not be reached? Oh, we got a new uh, event coming up. Counterfeit medicine has been an issue in our city for a while. Thanks to excellent police work, we're now able to trace the source. Prepare a sting operation against the responsible syndicate sock puppet. Okay, so does that mean the football event's almost over? Because this is the longest event ever. Uh, let's build a corridor. Okay, so if we had a corridor, will this make it to where we can have outside stuff? Maybe in this corner? I'm a little confused by what they're wanting here. Let's stick a door here at the end. Okay, so let's go to our outside. It's just really weird. Like, okay, so if I can put this here now, and if, if I have access this way? Okay, so it seems to like that, which is really weird, and I don't think I like the location of that, but for the time being, we'll stick it here, and maybe we can stick some more outside stuff down. Oh, man, we're going to have a medical helicopter. That is awesome. Alright, so I got some more emergencies to take care of here. Hopefully we'll get out of this football championship here relatively soon because it is absolutely insane the amount of time this has taken. I did not think it was going to be like this at all. Alright, here it comes. Boom! There we go. We got a medical helicopter. That's awesome. So, you know, it would be nice to be able to get up that uh, reputation limit to the 1200 that we need to actually complete this objective down here. Which is, uh, it's really strange that they've done this this way, but it is what it is. Uh, we've got a new helicopter. I would like to deploy this at least once this episode. We've actually built the hospital up mainly, and it's absolutely awesome looking. But yeah, we'll just continue to grind away here. Uh, we got the next shift. Of course, the football championship still isn't done for whatever reason. Okay, that's, that's a good thing. Whatever. Alright, tell me I can deploy my helicopter, please. Uh, let's go medical. Oh, we could do the helicopter now. It's probably overkill to do it, but I want to see it take off. So we're going to do the helicopter. Of course, it's another sports fight because why not? Hold on, let's watch this thing. All right, let's go ahead and get that. Hold on, let me get these other ones out of the way. That way we can watch this helicopter take off. It's going to be absolutely incredible. All right, so the crew is going to come out here to the helicopter. We're finally going to use this thing. This is going to be awesome. It better take off. It better not just disappear. Waiting for it, waiting for it. Come on. Oh, there it goes. Oh, what? <laughs> okay, that was really quick. It just kind of flew off the screen. That's fine. Oh, boy. But anyways, I think it's going to wrap it up for this episode of Rescue HQ. I'm going to try to off-camera get this football championship to complete. I don't understand what the hang-up is. A part of me thinks it's an objective down here. But there's really nothing we can do with those because we don't have the, uh, the reputation cap up. Uh, so hopefully I can figure this out, maybe off camera, but thank you guys for all the love and support on the Rescue HQ series. You guys are absolutely amazing. And wait, it's almost over. It's finally almost over. That is the longest event ever. Like that's been at least a week. So yeah, I'm going to take care of this. We'll see what we'll unlock. 
and we'll uh, jump right back into it next episode. But yeah, I do want to thank you guys for all the love and support, and we will see you guys next time.